All right, ready? You're my favorite cheese ball, Papa Doug. We love you, Papa Doug. We hope you feel better. Praying for you. We love you, Papa Doug. Bye. We love you. Hi, Uncle, Hi, Uncle Doug. Doug. We, we love you and miss you. you. We, we hope, hope you feel better. And we're praying, praying for you every day. Uncle Doug, we miss you. We love you. We're praying for you. We want you to be feeling better and we're praying for you and Aunt Becky pray for strength and we just hope that you are uh, able to feel the love from this family uh, through this video with all of our lively souls here at midnight <laughs> not quite that late but we love you bye bye oh Dougie Lou hey Dougie hang in there I know you're a fighter man keep battling big guy stay in there Prayers are with you, buddy. Hang in there. Papa Lou, Cameron Mitchell here. Hey, man, Jimmy said you're uh, not feeling so hot right now, so I'm just pulling for you, hoping feeling better soon, man. Need you out on that field, taking batting practice, playing pepper, riling up the troops, you know, getting going, man. All right, take care. See you soon. Oh, hey, I didn't see you there. Just getting a few ground balls in before I go to bed. Hey, dog, it's Jeff. Sticks, Uno Uno, Big Chief, the namesake behind the Jeff Nichols Award. Just sending you a little video. I want to say, hey, we're thinking about you. Um, hope you're feeling better. Sending you a little horse hair. And um, we miss you. Hope you're doing well. Get better soon. Love you. Mr. Lowe, sir. It's Carter McIntyre with a message from the Arts District in Los Angeles. Your son, James Lowe, told me you weren't feeling very well, so I thought I'd send you a message uh, as I was thinking about you and our lovely conversation at the wedding, James's wedding. And um, he told me that you were impressed that I'm a professional actor. I am, in fact, a card-carrying member of the Screen Actors Guild. And uh, I thought I'd just show you, so you know that, that's the real, I'm the real deal. large truck anyway um, I'm not as great at um, spontaneous improvisational monologues as your son James who can leave me a message for upwards of seven minutes straight in one breath talking about nothing but baseball uh, Brown University and the Cubs but I just want to say hello I'm wishing you the best no you're not feeling your best right now and um, this, this trucks about to back me over and I uh, just wanted to give you a little love out here from Los Angeles in the Arts District. So get well soon. We'll be thinking about you. Go Cubs. Dougie Fresh. Just wanted to say hello. Uh, getting my calisthenics on over here so I can stay in shape and, uh, you know, keep uh, Coach Ball Game in line here on the West Coast. Uh, take care, buddy. And now, playing left. Field, batting ninth, wearing number 11, Joshua Jackson. Doug, thinking about you. A lot of thoughts and prayers going your way, man. Miss you. Love you. Mr. Lowe, Galley here from Pennsylvania, your favorite Brown baseball first baseman. It's been quite some time since our visit. I think it was the fall of 2011 in North Carolina. Enjoyed that lasagna. I know I brought down some nice Pennsylvania pizza, and we had a great we had a great visit together. I miss you and Mrs. Lowe. Sending thoughts and prayers your way. We had a little Bible study Friday morning, and you will be my prayer and continue prayers. Love you, Mr. Lowe. God bless. I don't know if this thing is working or not. I can't tell. I believe so, but uh, Coach Ballgame, there you are, big guy. Uh, I need you to do me a huge, huge favor. I need you to deliver a message for me. De deliver a message for uh, Mr. Low Daddy, the senior Low Daddy, uh, Mr. Dougie Fresh, a.k.a. Dougie Fresh. Let him know that we're thinking about him and uh, wishing for a full recovery. 
Uh, I'm here for. I'm here if you need us. Uh, need me. Uh, hopefully you're doing well out in California. Coach Ball game and the Miss Mrs. Coach Ball game is doing well as well. Tell Avery Jean I said hey. Hello, Doug Lowe. I'm wearing the T-shirt. Home Run the movie. <laughs> Chuck Whetstone here. How you doing, brother? Uh, sorry about the light from this other computer. I'll turn that off. Hey, just wanted to say hi. Uh, so thankful for you. Thank you for being my friend these many, many years. I remember first time I met you was like 1978, 1979 in uh, Franklinville or Asheboro, wherever you were living out in the country at that time. And uh, when I was going to Chimney Lane, many fond memories of you. I love your whole family. Uh, great, great friends of mine now that they've all grown up and uh, got their own families. Anyway, I'm a little bit under the weather. Don't sound quite like myself. I'm not ready to sing right now. But I just want to send this greeting out to you, trusting to make your day, and uh, you'll feel a little bit better today. Be encouraged, my brother. Love you in Jesus' name. Bye-bye. Chuck Whetstone signing out. Bye-bye. Dougie, good to see you today, buddy. Me and Daddy giving our best shout-outs. Love you. Just keep pounding. Stay strong, buddy. We love you. It'll be classic. Me making a selfie movie. But anyway, my brother in... Honor of your love of Christ, I wanted to share a word of encouragement in Colossians chapter two. When you were dead, in your sins, God made you alive. You were a dead man. Now you're a live man forever. In Ephesians one, I know that when you believed, you were marked with a seal, and that seal was the Holy Spirit, and it's in your heart today. Finally, from Romans, I know that the God of hope will fill you with joy and peace as you trust Him. Even as you trust Him up to this day, may your trust hold steady as you embrace the joy and peace. Love you, my brother. Be encouraged. Hey, Papa Doug. I think so. There it is. Hi, we love you. Hope you feel better. We're here camping. There's the Springdale. <laughs> it's very. There's the Clydesdale. It's very disappointing <laughs> to hear that you're not feeling well. But we love you. And we're praying for you. It's yep. uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. We love you. We love right. you. And the unicorn loves you. Be normal. All right. Can you guys say? Oh, it's the unicorn. Love you, Papa Doug. Love you, Papa Doug. Okay. <laughs> See ya. Mr. Lowe, Greg Mesker here. Jimmy gave us a heads up what's going on and um, we just wanted to make this video and let you know that my wife and my family and I are thinking about you and hang in there and keep fighting. Hi Doug and Becky. We're gonna do a little Irving and Esther skit that we do when we go shopping for something expensive. We become Irving and Esther. When we want a bargain. We've been married 22 years. I, Esther, I think it's 42. <laughs> oh, it no, it's been 22 oh, wonderful mean. years. Well, oh, I mean, do you have life insurance? Oh. Uh. Nothing, just wonderful. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> Cut. Okay. Oh, I mean, do you have life insurance? I watch Dateline. Oi vey. What are you planning, Esther? Oh, nothing. I just wondered. Tomorrow we have to go to the JFK. They're giving a free lecture on hemorrhoids. Oh, cool. If we arrive early, we can get lots of freebies. Hey, there hey. will be rectal cream, candy, and maybe even a free stool sampling. Oh, muscle top. <laughs> oh, Esther, you're the best. Of course I am. Now go change your clothes. You look a mess. What? I can't hear you. And who's writing this crazy thing? 
What? Well, the girls are coming over to play Mahjong. If they leave early enough, maybe <laughs> we can hit the early bird special. Uh, at at Farmer Girl. Yeah, hey. On Tuesday, Pete gives away free pudding. Oh, uh, oh, you mean you're the best. Oh, uh, Esther. Mm, mm. I love you. How could we ever leave Florida? Uh. Oh, teeny. Love you. Love you. Hey. Hey, we just wanted y'all to know that we love y'all and we are praying for y'all. And we hope this brings a little extra joy to your day. Y'all gonna make me lose my mind. <laughs> Big Doug Low, the king. It's Don Harvey here saying hello, and um, I hope you're feeling well and uh, thinking about you and sending you a lot of good thoughts and prayers for a speedy recovery and hope you feel better. And uh, it was great to meet you at the wedding, and uh, you have such a wonderful family. I've had a great time getting to know them. And uh, I hope to see you soon, either out here or possibly I'll make it out to your neck of the woods. All right, you take care, and I hope to see you real soon. Hi, Doug. It's Ron and Linda here, and we just want to say that we've been praying for you and want you to feel better and mind the doctor and mind your wife, Becky. Let's and... not get crazy now. <laughs> <laughs> just... Uh praying for you hope that things will start to fall in place and that you'll get healed real quick and we love you and we and, love you and we're praying for you and um, we might be out there this summer hopefully <laughs> love you bye-bye <laughs>